It's Shane from Jags Journeys. I'm back today at Warner Brothers Movie World in the Gold Coast. Uh, just a quick video today, guys, because uh, we have heard that there's been a lot more progress on the Marvin the Martian ride in the Kids WB area since our last visit. So uh, apparently the actual ride itself may now even be put in. So uh, we're going to check that out today. Um, also, we're just going to have a general look around the park today just to see what else is happening here at Warner Brothers Movie World. Anyway, let's go now and check it out. So why don't you come along with me and join the journey. So I uh, just came into Movie World. Uh, we just got in today right on opening and uh, it's, uh, it's a Saturday and it's actually not that busy today, well so far anyway. It's actually a really warm day. It is supposed to storm later today in the afternoon so uh, we'll be uh, gone before then. Anyway, let's go check out the rest of the park. It's not much longer now for the bat wing to be down on maintenance. That's down until the 31st of March. Hey guys, so Superman is still down on maintenance uh, until the 30th of March. So uh, yeah, not much longer now and you're about to ride Superman Escape again. That's awesome. And there definitely has been some construction work going on in the Superman Escape envelope area. We're thinking it is Surf Rider coming over from Wet n Wild, but we'll keep an eye on this area to let you know. Also, they have removed the Joker here from the Arkham Asylum area. All right, guys, I reckon we'll kick off the day with a coffee. Hey guys, just at the Village Bean, the main street, looks like they've got a new drink out for Easter, the Choc Cream Egg. Now there's two versions here, so there's actually a mocha and a frappe as well. So you get chocolate and white chocolate fudge blended with a hint of vanilla, uh, topped with whipped cream, chocolate fudge drizzle, and you get a mini Choc Egg as well. So the uh, frappe is $7.50 and the uh, mocha is 7 If you want to add a shot of espresso, you can do so for just a dollar. And I reckon I'll have to try one of these, maybe later in the day. Well, actually, I thought I'd come in and get the mocha version of that cream egg uh, with coffee, of course. And I bumped into Adrian as well on here today from uh, AU Theme Park fan. How are you, mate? Good, mate. How are you? Very good. Let's get a coffee, yeah? Yeah. Hey, guys, I just want to give a really big shout-out to Nikki, David, TJ and Zach, and also to Lucas Hill. Uh, thank you all very much for buying me multiple coffees this week. It really is appreciated and it also really helps support Jag's Journeys. And if anyone else would like to support Jag's Journeys just like they did, the link is in the description below. It's also on the screen now. My Buy Me Coffees definitely helps me bring more videos just like this straight to you. Alright, so just finished the Choc Cream Egg uh, Mocha and they actually give you uh, a couple of Easter eggs as well, little mini ones to eat as well. So um, it's quite sweet. It wasn't quite as hot as a normal coffee, uh, but obviously got the extra shot of coffee. I uh, really enjoyed it, so uh, definitely this Easter we're here at Movie World, grab yourself a chocolate cream egg, mocha or frappe. Gonna head down to WB Kids and check out the progress on Marvin the Martian. Alright, 
So it was a week ago that we were here last and uh, when we were here they had done the backdrop, a little bit of painting and there was the ride controller booth but we've come down today and the actual ride has now been put in and heaps more theming so let's check it out. They've got some awesome theming going on there. They've got Marvin uh, on the top of a spaceship, which is actually on top of the ride operator booth. So from a theming perspective, it looks pretty cool. Well, there you go, guys. Uh, one week since we were here last, and the ride itself has now gone in. They've got a fence around the ride. They've even done some theming up there with uh, Marvin the Martian's dog as well. So, yeah, the ride is completely in. No doubt they've got a lot more uh, theming and um, wiring and electrical work to do as well. But uh, this is definitely on track for an April opening, so that is just awesome. Hey guys, uh, just on the side of the uh, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory chocolate store, uh, I haven't noticed this before, but it looks like they've uh, now filled in the windows there with uh, Tweety. And uh, again, this could have been done a little while ago, I've just hadn't noticed it. It's next to the uh, mural down here toward the kids' WB area. Hey guys, so uh, as I mentioned last time, Doomsday Destroyer is still down on maintenance until the 31st of March. So good thing is, uh, during the Easter school holidays, pretty much everything here at Movie World should almost all be open. If you truly want to tear a city apart, panic the masses. The toxins in these pipes will show you what happens when Metropolis is crippled by tomorrow. Hey guys, so it looks like Santa Fe Dogtown is gone. It's now Santa Fe Cantina Street Food and Bar. And it looks like they've got nachos and burritos on there. Just with some of the uh, combos here, for example, this one here, Combo 1, you get any burrito and nachos, a, a frozen uh, margarita and a sombrero for $29. Uh, that's pretty good. Uh, number 2 there, you got um, a soft drink, a souvenir cup, sombrero for $25 with any burrito and nachos. Um, or you can upgrade to the bottom of the soft drink uh, sipper for $5 more. So you should come down here and check it out. And check out the sombrero. It's pretty cool. So we decided to eat at the cantina and um, got a burrito. i tell you what, it's a decent looking burrito. So chicken burrito. Um, you get a drink and you also get a sombrero hat. I chose not to get a sombrero hat because I have several sombrero hats at home. But uh, Adrian over here, he looks like a classic, classic Mexican there. So uh, he's got his machine gun around his, uh, around his torso there. So, <laughs> hey, senora. He, he, he looks apart. He, he looks apart. Anyway, let's check out the burrito. I'll tell you what, it looks like a pretty decent size and it looks like the flies might like it as well, but uh, <laughs> hopefully I can eat it. Not as many flies as can buy, well. but anyway, uh, yeah, this is a pretty decent size uh, burrito. So we're going to dig in now. I actually got the guac, which was $3 extra as well. Anyway, we're going to dig in and check it out. Well, i got to say, uh, demolished that burrito and it was really good. So um, yeah, take a visit down here to the cantina, Santa Fe Cantina down here in the western area and grab yourself some Mexican. All right, so we've got a virtual queue to ride the Wallways Falls. So we're going to go straight on the ride right now. 
bitch, I'm on the rail. I wrap it, I bag it, I pack it for sale. Got feeling I'll speed out, I hit me to chill. I give it a thrill, I put it on film. Just so I get a plot that ain't real. Come to my section and flex. Alright, so we just came off the Wallace Falls ride and uh it was actually, um, there's actually a few of the audio um, and special effects that were not working today uh, compared to, I think about three or four weeks ago, uh, we rode this ride and a lot more was working. It was, uh, still a good ride, but um, yeah, it's a bit unfortunate. But hopefully they will um, get that sorted out. Hopefully. Hey guys, don't forget that Wild West Falls Ride will be down on annual maintenance between the 24th of April and the 23rd of June. Guys, don't forget that DC Rivals Hypercoaster will be down on annual maintenance from the 24th of April until the 23rd of June. Anyway guys, that was just a quick look today at Movie World. It was really awesome to see that the Marvel the Martian ride is actually now actually in. So now they're just doing all the connecting, they'll be commissioning the ride and they'll be doing a lot more theming, staff training. So. Hopefully this will be open for the April school holidays, so I haven't seen an actual release date yet. Just keep checking online, and we'll continue to provide you some updates when we can as well. Anyway, if you did like the video today, make sure you give us a like and thumbs up, that's always greatly appreciated. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next journey.